What's up guys, it's 123 Stealth Bomber here and I'm going to bring you another video on the Man of War editor to do waypoints. Um, now first of all, waypoints will work for any unit, but for this example I'm using a truck. Any unit will work. So first thing you want to do is go to F3 mode. You're going to want to go to F3 mode and then hit W on your keyboard and then hit 6 on your keyboard. Uh, this menu of that's called tags of selection will pop up and then you're going to type in anything you would like. Um, as you can see this green lettering to indicate that you have typed it in and then you're going to hit OK and you're going to go to waypoints. You're going to hit add and you're going to name it whatever you like. I just named it waypoint in this case. And you're going to hit add where my mouse was and you're going to select it over open ground and you'll see there's like this cone shape. Um, you're going to select it again and hit add again. And you'll notice there's a yellow line between those two waypoints. This indicates uh, they are both connected. And if you zoom in, you'll see a little arrow to indicate which direction um, it is going. So I'm just going to place a couple of random waypoints around the map. Yeah, it should be good for now. So now what we're going to do now is uh, go to triggers and again, name it anything you like. And then you're going to go to condition and go to entities, select entities. You're going to go to tag and select the tag that you named that unit for. So in case, in my case, it's GMC. Then you're going to go to commands and search for actor to waypoint. Select that one, and again, select the same tag that you used for entities. And then, for waypoint, you're going to type in the number that uh, you want the unit to start at. And then for approach, I, for my uh, purposes, I typed in teleport and rotate, so it teleports the unit to the position the waypoint starts at, and it rotates it to the unit, to which way it needs to go. <clears throat> so we're going to test it out. And as you can see, it works fine. It moves by itself. And it works. Yeah, it works pretty good. So again, I'm going to say this, that this is a basic video uh, on waypoints. There's a lot more to know about waypoints. This is just a very basic video on how it works and what it is. Um, I will be posting a more advanced tutorial on waypoints later on, but from my uh, after this video, all my other videos are going to require you to know what a waypoint is and how to use them. So, um, if you don't know how to use it yet, this video will help you out a lot. Please do know how to use this because this does help out a lot. It's uh, very useful and it's used in a lot of stuff that I do. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you um, have any questions or comments, leave a question down below or in my channel or whatever. And I will see you guys next time.